No, I had a rhyme go in my mind and it means nothing. Rhyme? A rhyme. I had a rhyme go through my mind. A rhyme. A rhyme. Rhyme. Yes. Rhyme? Rhyme. 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 Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Reactions, the Idiots. I'm Corbin. I'm stupid. And you can follow us on Instagram, Instagram and Twitter, Twitter for more juicy content. It's so juicy. Thanks, Ashley. Thank you for so some Patreon followers for your Twitter account. And for those of you who don't know the relationship between Ashley and I, Ashley is Corbin's daughter. I look great for 50. <laughs> uh, today, uh, we are reacting to, uh, I don't know. I don't know, Rick. You don't know? I don't know. All right, well, let me know when you're ready. Okay, well, I'm ready. Great, read this. Uh, 1958, well, you know, this is getting blocked. Uh, it's been amazing to us that stuff from the 1950s and 60s that we would think nobody is really paying attention to anymore. Yeah. Oh no, my friends. There are like people who go night and day without sleep waiting for somebody to do this content. So 1958, it's a Hindi language song. Midanam chin chin chu. Chim chimini, chim chimini, chim chim chui. Asleep is so oh. <clears throat> Note, this is a Hindustani song from the 1958 Indian film, Howrah Bridge. It was sung by Gita Dutt and was picturized. <gasps> Helen? In the movie, Helen plays chin chin chu a flirtatious dancer from Shanghai who sings the song. The song became highly popular and rejuvenated the career of the singer Gita Dutt. Or Dutt. I think it's Dutt. It was also the first major hit for Helen. Freaking awesome. Yeah! You asked for Helen? Heck yeah! Uh, and it's subbed by our subbers. Hey, thank you, subbers! It should be a better name than subbers. Yeah, how dumb. about the... Uh, like, Say your real name. Stupid suburb. The submarines. Here we go.
Oh, wow, that ended abruptly. <laughs> sure did. There was probably that a went over spoiler. the cliff. <laughs> there was probably a spoiler we didn't wow. see. Wow, that was a fun song. That was really fun. So I got a question. Oh, sorry, Amazon delivery. I noticed something about Helen in this that I didn't notice in her dance number in Cholet. That she's um, not Indian? No, it's interesting you should say that. Is she, is she Northeast Indian? Oh, are they more... Uh, yes. Um... Uh, Northeast Indian people, mm. most Americans would 100% look at them and go, Chinese, without any hesitation whatsoever. Yours truly included until... Indrani taught me the difference. Gotcha. And we were specifically in a restaurant. Because I was hoping we weren't going down another Shredevi. Uh... Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, we were in a restaurant, um, and, and I, I, I just didn't know that about Northeast Indians. Gotcha. And, sh and, and Indrani said, oh, yeah, and Northeast Indians are, like, a lot of them would be very deeply offended if you misconstrue them really? and call them Chinese because they're, they're freaking Indians. Well, that so makes sense. It does, but I, I remember bringing it up to Ashley, and she was saying, really? I said, yeah. I said, look up Northeast Indian women. Just mm -hmm. look it up on Google. She opened it up and she looked at it and she went, oh my goodness, I would absolutely have made that mistake and think that they're Chinese. Wow. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Wow. Yeah. And, yeah, and yeah, I yeah. got very much from the way she looked in this. Now, I know the character she's playing in this is actually supposed to be Chinese. Yeah. But I, I, I'm wondering and guessing based on the way that she was looking here, and we've only seen her in this and in Cholet, that is that, is that where she's from? Is she from Northeast India? Uh, don't ask me. I don't know. Okay. I, I actually, I thought you might know. Yes. Oh, well, now you don't know. Uh, I could look it up, though. Is that her name, though? Is it like Cher? Oh, and I didn't... Yes. Helen? Yeah, it's like she Cher. Just goes by Helen. She just goes by Helen. Which is impressive, because Helen's a common name. I know. No, but there's only one Helen. Oh, and I didn't it's finish the like story. It's not like Oprah or like right. Cher. That's no. like, no one's named that. Exactly. But you got like... like Madonna. It'd be one thing if it was like... Uh, Joe. Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Bob. Um, but to finish the story, we were at a restaurant and she asked the server that was serving us if she, where she was from and it turned out that she was from Northeast and she definitively looked like she could have been in my perception from China and she seemed genuinely happy to know that we had recognized her as being Indian. Mm. So for those of you in Northeast India, you can put some comments in here. That's the understanding is that you guys definitely... Uh, you, you have all of that genetic makeup being looking like you could be Chinese because, oh, what a shock, Indians are Asian. Um, and, and it's a, a very wonderful thing to know the difference for me. It made me very happy to know I, I won't She's make that difference again. Anglo-Indian father and a Burmese? Burmese mother. Okay. I don't know what those mean. I don't know what that means yeah, in terms of what part Burma. But that was really, okay. really, really great. So the, so the song was so fun. Uh, Harken back to yesteryears when you were a child, huh? It uh, did, back in the night. Well, I was in the 1850s. That's more my neck of the woods. True. Yeah. Uh, but it was, it was really funny. Right? Like old school, like um, uh, what, uh, the duck soup era. The, um, the, the Groucho Marx. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the big musical numbers that were all like a performance in the thing and yeah like the pre MGM yeah. big musicals when they mm -hmm. did it felt just like those kind of films yeah so it was really a lot of fun really catchy uh, I know this they said this is like her first big hit so that's probably why we didn't see her because she's like known as a legendary dancer right, right. That's, that's her thing like we didn't see her dancing too much in this uh, like no too, like too much of like like crazy oh wow that's crazy yeah it's pretty easy dancing um, so I'm obviously since it's their first hit, she's not just going to be a name and get you yeah, but that's what she's known for is being a dancer. I would like to know more stuff that she's done. Uh, like if there's some famous dance numbers that mm -hmm. really show off her, her, yeah. her prowess as a dancer. Yep. Uh, what, you know what style she was known for? I, I don't know. No idea. Well, you do. Yeah. I know you guys know. And uh, you can let us know. Yep. Because we're dumb. Yep. And I think what we should do is once we have some of that exposure, I think the Cholet number you should do. Dress like Helen and just do it. No. In her outfit, in front of a fire. Corbin, don't dance. You do it in Rithik's underwear. Not in front of these dogs. <laughs>